Collecting items can be a really fun part of any game. So let's create a pickup object that your player can collect, which will then increase their health or some other value. I'll create a new project using the Windy Woods template, which is a platformer. If you already have a project to work with, I would still recommend doing this in Windy Woods first so you can get a good understanding of how it works before you add it to your own project. You need some assets for this tutorial, so go ahead and download them from the link in the description. Then in Game Maker, go under Tools, click on Import Local Package, and then select the asset package that you just downloaded. You will see this, where you just need to click on Add All and then Import. You now have all the assets you need for this tutorial. Create a new object and name this OBJ Pickup Health. In the object editor, assign the SPR Pickup Health sprite to it. Now let's program what happens when the player collides with this pickup. Add a new event, which will be a collision event with OBJ player, which is found under objects, characters, and then player. Now if you're using GML Visual, look to this side, and if you're using GML Code, then look here. In the event, add an if condition. This will check if the HP or health of the other instance, which is the player, is less than the max HP of that same instance. That means the player's health is not full, meaning they can pick this up and gain another heart. If this condition is true, we will change the value of a variable. The variable is the HP of the other instance, which again is the player. And we are increasing that by 1, so the player gets another heart. Now you can change this value to something else if you want to change how much health the player gains from this pickup. Then destroy the pickup instance itself. Now open the RM level 1 room, which is the first level in this project, and select the instances layer where you can place any objects. Then from the asset browser, drag your health pickup object and drop it in the room. I'll add another one here, and I'll also add an enemy between these hearts so I can test losing hearts and gaining them back. Now run the game and you won't be able to pick up the heart initially because your health is full. If you touch an enemy and get hurt, you can then collect your pickup and gain a heart. Right now it's looking very simple, so let's add a particle effect that plays when you collect a heart. In the same event that you were just working in, under the same condition, use this to create an effect. I'll create a ring effect, but you can choose something else. It will be created above all objects, its size will be medium, and I'll give it a pink or fuchsia color. All of this is up to you. If you're using GML Visual, make sure to enable the relative options for X and Y. This means the particle will be created at the same position as the instance that is running the code. Run the game, collect a heart, and you will now see your particle effect. Now if you want to create a different pickup, just create a new object for it, add a collision event, and instead of increasing the HP, increase some other variable in your player object. And you may not need this condition here if what you are collecting is not limited. Watch this tutorial next to improve your game further and I will see you in the next video.